two. All right, guys, so finally back home in Texas. It's time to get back in the groove of things. So I'm gonna get on the cardio right now, I'm sipping on my espresso here, um, just getting right back into the routine of things. So I'm gonna do 15 minutes of walking, uh, mostly just for digestive purposes. Um, yesterday I lost another pound, so I'm weighing in at 249 now, waking up. Um, so the body's really moving, my metabolism is going crazy. Honestly, gonna have to keep feeding me. Um, but that's great, so that means everything is going to just how we wanted, and I'm gonna be able to grow into this show, eat into this, and really make sure that I'm the best bodybuilder I can possibly be. After I get done with cardio, I'm gonna head into Destination Dallas, headquarters of Gasman Better Bodies. Uh, I got a couple things to do there. So one, Branch is gonna take a look at me. He's my coach. Um, we're gonna go over our plan, everything that's going on, and food and everything like that, and kind of decide what we're gonna do with my body. So coming up on Saturday, I'll be nine weeks out and um, things will probably start to shift into more of a conditioning mode as we get going here. But conditioning is going just as planned, like I said. So very excited about that. Number two that we're doing there is I have a product shoot. Um, they have some pants and some shorts that they want me to shoot in the next couple days. So today we're going to be going in, getting as much of that done as we can. Um, it's kind of fun. So I'll take you guys along for that and just kind of show you guys really what my job is. Um, if you will. All right. So. Branch looked at me, didn't get the photo shoot done because I have a chiropractor appointment that I completely forgot about. So I am about to get in the car, haul ass to the chiropractor appointment that I'm gonna be late for, but I really need this from flying home from Florida. So we'll see you guys at the chiropractor. Hey guys, so I'm at the chiropractor. I'm like five minutes late, but we're checked in and we'll see the doctor in a minute. Not me. All right, at the chiropractor. What's up? You know the boss himself. Yeah. You guys have seen him already in the recovery video, but just want to keep you guys along for the day. So I'm going to get cracked, snapped, popped, all that good stuff, and then I'll see you guys after. All right, guys, chiropractor's done. On to the next thing. I got to grab a meal in between, and then I'm headed back to do the photo shoot. Get that done with Edmund. We have some pants to shoot, some shirts to shoot, lots of new clothes for you guys. So we'll be showing you that, taking you along for the ride. All right, guys, so guests from the header bodies headquarters here. I got Edmund. He's about to shoot some pictures of me. We're going to take some pictures of some shorts, some pants, and... All right, we're in the photo shoot room. We got Ian. What's up? We got Hane. We got Edmund. Three, two, one. Yep. Like he said, um, this is fun and easy. Um, I do this a lot for gas, uh, for the website mostly. All right, guys, so we had the photo shoot at destination. Got that done. Now I'm going to eat a pre-workout meal, take a 15, 20 minute nap, and then we're gonna go train chest at uh, Metro Plano. So keep you guys along for the ride. You guys have been asking for a chest workout. So we'll do that next. Guys, so straight to it here at Metro Plano. We're gonna get right into some flies here. I'm gonna start with dumbbell flies. I'm gonna do three or four sets here, get my pecs warm. Then I'll go into another fly and then we'll go into dumbbell incline. So it's gonna be kind of a run and gun here. Uh, music's loud, I'm just gonna train my ass off. Uh, give you guys maybe a few cues here and there, but let's get after it. Uh, 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 uh,
Alright y'all, so I did the flies on the dumbbells there, incline. Uh, I was going to do a cable fly, but the cable fly machine is taking up. It seemed like it's going to be a little bit. I ain't really feeling like waiting. I'm trying to get it in, smash it here. So I'm going to come outside. We have this awesome flat bench press press out here. Uh, it's from the original Metroplex branch. Ronnie used to beat the shit out of this thing. It's been broke a million times, but it's awesome. It's smooth and it's heavy as hell. Feels good on the pecs. So I'm going to crush this thing. Uh, probably going to do five sets of 15 to 20 here. Really volumize things up. And then we'll go back inside and do some incline uh, heavy compound of some sort. So go kill this and uh, we'll see you guys at the incline. gonna do these dumbbell incline uh, presses and just really get after it here go up uh, I started with the hundreds and my left elbow is just really tight into the forearm into the tricep head and I can't press without using more delt than pec because it's rotating my arm in that direction I just don't feel like it's safe for my pec so I'm gonna use a different movement to really attack the incline that I feel is a little more safe for the joint um, sometimes you just have to make judgment calls in the middle of a session and that's what I'm doing right here. All right, so as you guys can see here, I went to this hammer strength incline plate loaded machine. And mainly why is because the handle is stationary. So my hand can't rotate at all, which is what's happening with the dumbbells. I was getting some internal rotation, causing that forearm tricep pain and putting me in an awkward position. This is keeping me in a more locked position so we're just gonna get as many clean squeeze reps as we can and really focus on that. Yep. 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 
Do a fly here. So I'm gonna set things up. And then we're gonna do a pec deck fly. Uh, cables here, and then uh, finish things up with another press. Maybe a little bit on. Shot push ups here. Or, well, you can tell I'm a little depleted and a little out of it. To finish up chest here, we're going to be doing some push ups. So, I've done a couple incline movements, a couple flat movements, a couple flies. Now, we're just going to finish up with some push ups, really get full muscle exhaustion, and get the fuck out of here. So, let's do it. I'm really focusing on trying to keep this in the pecs, so flaring elbows out just a little bit at about a 45 degree angle really trying to keep it out of the triceps because i'm more tricep shoulder dominant here um i'm resituating but um, as i go I'm just gonna try to get as many as i can perfect reps here really squeezing the chest at the top uh for me it feels better as more of a decline uh to push my body away from my hands in that direction but really side here so just trying to get the last little bit out of the pecs Back at the house, we got chest done, we got a shower done, we got post-workout eaten. So now I got to pack up some shirts and some hats and ship them off to you guys. So I'll show you guys how I do that, uh, my little office setup and how I ship everything out. All right guys, so like I said, I got some t-shirts and some hats to ship out to you guys. So I'm going to get on my computer here. I have a shipping website that I use. Um, and I'm just going to <clears throat> type in the information that you guys send me. I'll do this. Um, I have pre-saved packages on here. That's like um, whatever I need. Uh, so this one, I need to ship a hat. So this is what I'm going to be doing. Um, and then you guys can see next. Um, I have these bags here. I have a hat here. Um, just put them in. And get them all tucked away in here. So we get the hat in there. Get it pushed down in, in the package all the way then i'll peel this silver off stick it so uh, like so it's stuck back to itself and i will print off my label here get the label ready this website's really easy it just kind of you weigh stuff you type in the address um, click and ship download labels and then Right here, you guys, as you guys can see, my printer. Um, so the printer here is just one that I got off of Amazon with pretty much everything here is I just got off of Amazon. It's really, really easy um, to kind of start your own merchandise business. Really the hard part is 
having someone print the shirts for you and the other hard part is having people buy them you know you just got to have the fan base or the people that want to buy your shirts so really appreciate you guys that buy and, and support my merchandise and um if you want something guys just message me or send me an email all my stuff is in the bio below so um you guys can check that out and then i'm gonna get these packages done and um afterwards then we'll run to the post office all right guys so just finishing up here i'm about to run to the post office i was just going to show you guys i just kind of have the t-shirts on the floor right here right now i'm um, just kind of spread out in their individual sizes but i have a big uh, metal industrial shelving unit coming that i'm going to put all the shirts on as well as we're getting a bunch of different shirts ordered um different styles um, so if you guys down in the comments below, let me know which ones you guys would like these styles. Uh, I'm going to throw four different ones up and you guys kind of let me know which ones you like. Back at the house, just got done at the post office. And really, the day is kind of over, guys. I got a couple more meals. Um, besides that, it's really chill. I'm going to sit down and start editing this video for you guys. So thanks for following along. I appreciate you guys. Uh, like, subscribe, all that good YouTube stuff, and I uh, would we'll appreciate you guys. We'll be seeing you again soon.